What's up guys and gals, it is I once again Yusuf Al Sanad and today guys and gals I want to talk about and review Daniel Gold Harbour's 2018 psychological horror film, psychological slash mystery horror film, Cam, directed by Daniel Gold Harbour himself, written by Aya Mizai and the original story was written by Aya Mizai alongside Daniel Gold Harbour and of course Isabel Link Levy and this film guys and gals my god this film was quite a ride a very fun and quite terrifying ride which yours truly loves so much Daniel Gold Harbour's cam worked so well as both a horror film a psychological horror film and a mystery film both of those elements worked so well together in this movie cam cam guys and gals was so terrifying because this film is based on a true story the true story of former cam girl or webcam mom Model, who's also the writer of the movie, Aya Mizai, and this film, guys and gals, is so grounded and so realistic, so much so this film was terrifying and scary, and yours truly has experienced all the torments and all the harassment online, not exactly to the extent in which Aya Mizai has experienced and endured, but yours truly knows that fear and knows that paranoia of being online and being stalked by someone, by some stranger by some random user online who wants to make your life a living nightmare. That's exactly what Aya Mizai has experienced and endured. And this film, guys and gals, Daniel Gold Harbour's Cam, is based on her story, the story of Aya Mizai, a former cam girl or a former webcam model online. And this story, guys and gals, is so real once again and so terrifying yet so good. And the basic story of Daniel Gold Harbour's Cam tells the tale of a young woman, a young woman named Alice Ackerman and Alice is known by her username online as a webcam model or cam girl Lola underscore Lola or simply known as Lola. Lola is her persona online as a webcam model or cam girl who seeks to break through the top 50 spot of most popular cam girl or better yet the hottest cam girl online until she reaches the top spot and maintains that spot up there as the best cam girl and the hottest too, Lola aka Alice Ackerman lives by a set of rules, a set of rules in which she does things by her way online as a webcam model or as a cam girl in which she limits herself as to what she can and can't do or cannot do which includes anal or some other forms of sex, role plays basically or sex plays. Her show, the show of Lola basically is tamed and not so much out there or crazy even though Lola at the beginning of the movie slits her own throat I don't know why but that's basically part of the show which gains her so many views and with so many views guys and gals it means tokens and more tokens means money that and you becoming the most popular webcam model online that's the intent of Lola or Alice Ackerman in her profession as a webcam model or cam girl to become the best and hottest and most popular online things are going so well for her for Lola in what she does as a profession until one day guys and gals Alice's account was hacked by someone some random user online who Alice does not know and because of that guys and gals Alice's livelihood and her well-being is threatened because of this user because of this random user online who wants to make her life a living nightmare Alice Ackerman's life that is and Alice guys and gals tries to find out who exactly this person is and expose him or her whoever he or she may be. Now guys and gals, as someone who does view these webcam models online on various websites, one of which I love so much, and for you guys and gals who want to know, that website is Chatterbait. Chatterbait, guys and gals, I am a normal user or regular user online. Chatterbait, guys and gals, is so awesome, and yes, yours truly does watch these webcam models, men, women, and trannies, and what have you. I love them all, guys and gals, I do, because because they are so awesome and of course sexy as hell but this movie guys and gals is so terrifying in the way it's so realistic and the way it's so grounded in reality and the fact that this movie is based on a true story the true story of Aya Mizai is the reason why this movie Daniel Gold Harbour's cam is so scary and so effective as a horror movie a psychological horror movie which combines elements of mystery and suspense both of which worked so well in this movie 
Madeline Brewer, guys and girls, was so amazing and so great. And my God, I love her expressions and her face and the way she emotes. Madeline's expressions, guys and girls, and reactions was so on point and something to behold. In this movie, which I do recommend you guys and girls watch because this movie is so great and so effective as a horror film and works so well as a mystery suspense thriller. And of course, guys and girls, the biggest highlight of this movie is without question the performance by Madeline Brewer who's so great in this movie and my god guys and girls you have to watch the movie for her performance alone because she is that good and that great and I love her so much what's up guys and girls I'm really sorry but right now it's currently nighttime and I just wanted to let you guys and girls know other aspects of this movie cam which I loved so much but forgot to mention early on in my review of the movie which you guys and girls are watching right now but those aspects of the movie which I loved so much in Cam one of which is the fact that Lola or Alice Ackerman is trying to keep her life private as private as possible because obviously if you guys and girls are a public figure online basically a webcam model or a cam girl or cam guy or transgender dude or transgender dudette which is basically a woman who's trans as you guys guys and girls will know you will be assaulted or the likelihood of you being assaulted online is possible be it your personal life or the life of your family members your life guys and girls is in danger if you are indeed a public figure such a public figure is Alice Ackerman otherwise known as Lola and the funny thing guys and girls is the fact that Alice Ackerman does want to tell her mother about what she does being a cam girl and being a webcam model on who exposes herself to other guys and gals online for their pleasure and amusement and that's what she does guys and gals in the process she earns tokens too and tokens guys and gals means money and the more money you have the more popular you get online which makes you even greater of a webcam model or cam girl online Alice Ackerman did want it to tell her mother what she does even though it was so hard to do so which honestly guys and and girls is very understandable especially considering what she does and the fact that many young men women and trans go through what she's going through especially when it concerns her livelihood and what she does for a living and financial income which basically comes from her tokens online as you guys and girls will know is her work as a webcam model or a cam girl to make money and to basically live her life the way she wants as a free spirit and someone who is independent Dependent, even though many will think that what she does is so indecent but guys and gals that's her life her body her mind her heart her sexuality everything she does is for her and those who know what she does and those who she lets know what she does online as a webcam model or cam girl and she wanted once again guys and gals to tell her mother what she does even though once again it's so hard to do so in the case with Alice Ackerman it's so hard because until Till she breaks through the top spot past the top 50 spot in the top 10 spot at least she will not tell her mother what she does and her mother guys and gals is played so well by Melora Walters who yours truly has seen in Boogie Nights Paul Thomas Anderson's Boogie Nights from 1997 which is such a great movie that deals in the porn industry which is quite ironic the fact that Madeline's character Alice Ackerman is a webcam model or cam girl working online through sex and through chatting with people and basically masturbating and shit to make money to make a profit and to become famous online so yeah guys and girls quite ironic indeed and this film once again like boogie nights is so great i cannot express to you guys and girls how great it is the only member of her family of alice ackerman's family who knows what she does is her brother guys and girls her brother who is jordan jordan ackerman who's played so well by Devin Druid, even though he has a limited amount of time in the film as an actor playing his character, but he's so great, guys and gals, he is. But yeah, guys and gals, Jordan is the only one who knows what his sister does, what Alice does for a living, and he's quite supportive, guys and gals, which is so accurate to exactly what these webcam models and their family members do in their lives, support them and back them up the way other families do to support their family however way they can, and their relationship guys and gals is tested
arrested because Alice Ackerman's account once again was hacked by someone, by some random user online, and because of this, her relationship with her brother is tested, and the film guys and gals like her expressions and the way she behaves and the way she acts in the movie. Madeline as Alice Ackerman is so intense, this film becomes more and more intense as it goes on, until the very end guys and gals, because the ending and the climax of the movie is so great and so intense and disturbing too because that ending guys and gals is the definition of insane and intense and this film guys and gals once again is so great and I love it. Realistic, accurate and downright grounded in reality is what this movie is, Cam. Madeline guys and gals is so awesome that she is and thank you guys and gals for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please like, comment, subscribe if you wish and do check out my gaming channel where I do let's play series, gaming content and so much more. Until next time, peace out, take care, adios amigos, au revoir and sayonara.